heavy occasionally, but for the most part, he's probably going to be staying on the soldier role. I think we're live. Oh, are we? Oh. I well, am live. Yeah, starting first half, holy smokes. But uh, anyways, we're going to be rolling out to this first mid. Before we do, Ips, any prediction? <laughs> uh, mix up, take it. Uh, what's the score? What are you calling the score? Uh, 5-3 mix up. 5-3 mix? Uh, I'm gonna kind of agree with you here, but I'm gonna go with a 5-2 mix up, and is this a pause? Pause is ended. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Really short. But, uh, you know, we talked about the big gym, so I'm gonna be watching him this first mode. Let's do it. As it uh, looks like, oh, he was the one that lagged out, I guess, so, you know, kind of a delayed rollout for visitors. Enigma's already in the air, and while wow, Boomer's gonna get picked off early to ruin here, so... I mean, Chess Club, when their Roamer lags out at the start, kind of hard to go to middle, so... Yeah, they just, just gonna be content to hold two, yeah. Should spam that choke point right now, just to stall out Mixup there. Separating is out there nicely on this buy right now. Mixup just really coming in uncontested right now. Just Making room, making frags, and... Yeah, TLR is pushing in really fire. aggressively here with YZ, or Ruin, actually. And they're able to pick off visitors really low. Is he in a crater here? No, KBK has the Uber, though, but they're two down. I mean, Mixo's gonna be pushing in the last here, using this number advantage. And here comes the pop. Is Try gonna get Ubered in time? Yes, Try does get flash from KBK. A lot of flashing going around. Uh-oh, TLR goes down, <laughs> Ruin goes down. Uh-oh, this is a lot of trouble for Mixup here. They will do and the trapped one. at top. So three for zero I came to that went surprisingly good on the hold for for team red here for chess club. Yeah, platinum's gonna get caught here, and this is gonna be chess club with a nice retake of two though. I feel like mix up potentially um rushing their offense in the last there and getting a few too many people in on the Uber, but uh chess club now can be pushing in the middle with their two man advantage and trying to take this point as visitor goes for the air shot. On TLR, but not able to connect. We have a lot of aggression going on here. Visitor on the better game, he kills himself. KDK on, on six health. Oh, Alpha wow. with a nice 3k bombing in. And he hits it low. What is Absolutely that play? Absolutely huge mid by Alpha. Yeah, Alpha, Alpha also, gets by a the 4K. way, a member of the European Kraken squad, just saying. Yeah, Alpha, <laughs> I mean, I never really got to talk about the other players on this team, but, you know, Alpha's kind of been the guy. He's been around TF2 for a long time, backing up for high-end teams, but just never really getting the start, and you know, this is finally his chance to get to play demo, and definitely, uh, with a 4k there, showing that, you know, he's a force to be contended with. He's with him, like, from my experience with him, he's just working, like, scout, demo, medic for, for us in the European scene, and he's always really, really good, uh, for not really playing in our, let's say, mindset, and our rule set, and, uh, he never really felt like underperforming, so I don't expect him to be underperforming this land as well, and maybe it's just time to shine. Oh, that's a good call, so I'm gonna give Platinum the cam here, as he's gonna definitely be the one calling the hard blue when to use this or not. As the crit comes in and he's able to drop KDK. Wow. Wow. Yeah, flanking the sewers. Trying to get behind the enemy crits here, but they're not gonna be able to do it. Yeah, just a lot of frags going in Mixup's favor. YZ50 getting really low while wow, hits a nice neat shot on the Boomer, and Alpha's kind of caught out here in No Man's Land, and wow, just Takes a really one. nice clean crits coming out of Plat. They're able to drop KDK with his first sticky, and it just left uh, Chess Club scattered, so really nice crits out of Plat there. And they're going to be rolling into two here, and they should be able to take this point yeah. for free. I don't think that um, Chess Club is going to contest second even. They will just play it safe. I'm surprised how they won't uh, counter the crits now, because they will never get charged in time before the crits, and they get the heavy out, look, Jimbo, big visitors have running the heavy. Surprised yeah, so the crits comes in, and while well, Plat, with a nice crit snipe, is able to drop the medic wow. and a scout, so while well, Platinum just doing work with those crits, pipes the heavy twice, Ruin's well, gonna just gonna come in for down. the cleanup, and this should be just, yeah. wow, really nice round coming out of Platinum there, showing, you know, hey, I'm still a really good demo man at this game. Is I mean that crits in the mid and then another crits at last. So. Did I point out that I'm a big fan of platinum? By the way, I'm his biggest fanboy probably in the European scene. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> well, I love I mean, him on demo and soldier. So Plat, I mean, he's saying I'm the man of the match at the moment. So giving him the cam here at mid. Alpha and Plat both pretty equal here in terms. No one really hurting each other at the moment. So just a pretty stalemate mid. This is going to come down to the soldier aggression. 
Next says that we do have the soldiers bombing in right now. Both crates of scout really aggressive on platinum. Platinum goes down. Wow, try and boomer connecting for 3k here. And wow, just YZ50 up, and that is a full white. So wow. Really that nice aggression. That turned out really good from them. They seem to. Wow. They wow, seem to understand that. KDK air shotting Enigma. They seem to understand that if they want to get into mix up spaces and if they really want to win mids, they just have to go really balls to the wall, if you want to call it like this, and just rush them. They took out yeah. platinum, uh, the, the enemy that are really relatively easy. For Two sure, for sure. As uh, with Mixup here, we see him holding up top on these bats, pulling out the heavy sniper defense. So, kind of a classic digging in, getting ready for the offense to push in. And let's see, where's Try? I mean, Mr. Direct Rocket Soldier himself, the leader of this team, as he's pushing in towards this left side. A really early pop. Uh oh. Alpha goes down to a sticky trap. Try trying to fight this heavy. This Uber is not going to work out. They're going to need to get out of dodges. Platinum does go down. Try is trying to shock him down the scout. The scout dropped on the 30 health, but uh uh. Anytime you lose your demo man that early on a push, I mean, you're pretty much doomed to failure, so. Pretty much a shot. full wipe coming out Probably of chest. Yeah. yeah. Harblue has nice. his uber charge as well. Platinum is just respawning, but I mean, mixed up. They're going to be pushing out on this. Rightfully so. They've already got both their scouts on point. Platinum's pushing up towards Choke, and yeah, TLR and Har Harblue's already calling it. TLR. Yeah, they want to push this it. in the middle. They're going through is to not run into sticky traps. Two people on top of them. They might uh -oh, get they're... forced here. Yeah, they're, they're going to get getting... forced. But they're losing two people for that exchange. Might get, might lose Ooh. another couple of people now. Yeah, so bleeding down point. three people. Mixup's going to keep going here. They're going to leave a scout on cap and just push everyone up, I imagine. Yeah, here we go. This is just the classic mix-up, as you nice. call it. I mean, just this aggression coming out. They realize, you know, we've got plenty of picks. We don't have to stack a point to block any forward spawns. Let's just keep going. So they roll in a two off of their three-man advantage, and you know they're gonna secure themselves another point for free. Uh, that's a heavy on defense for last from uh, Chess Club here, in top right corner. Cause they know they might head rushes into last already. They have a charge advantage on, Chick uh, on Chess Club right now, but like they're in a defensive position, so they can't really work off that. They have to stay at last and then just wait for Blue to come in at one point. So it's going to be interesting to see how Mixup is actually going to approach this. I guess they're aware that there's a heavy. They spotted it nicely already. Yeah, certainly. These invite teams aren't just going to run in and all of a sudden go, Oh, there's a heavy there, and we didn't know that. I mean, they're going to be scoping things out. So, I mean, what would you like to see out of Classic Mixup? Ips, would you like to see a sniper? Um, maybe a like heavy? a sacrifice play to get the force of, of like a, a demo or something. I don't really, shouldn't really approach this. This heavy on the far right, they should try to get to the demo. Or the medic with like three people to force it. Keep their Uber on second to be able to like we call it recycle. I don't know how do you guys call it to be able to like hold second with the respawn waves coming in and then get rid of this Uber versus Uber situation. Because so far mixups aggression is just uh, what's really gonna win them the game and. They can't do that really with an heavy armor. Yeah, as we see here, Ruin running in really aggressively on the far right side, able to drop Boober to 38 health, but Ruin's gonna go down, so here that we go. That was a play, like, he's yeah, got a sniper or spy or something in the end now. Mm-hmm, sniper, spy, heavy, as we do have Boomer actually pushing up really aggressively, he's able to kill Platinum, well, yeah, and he's on a hard blue, hard blue down to 50 health, well, really nice play out of Boomer, and Chess Club's pushing this off of the Sacrifice Blade, tries going right into the combo, both Ubers getting forced here. Classic mix up with a slightly worse Uber, but uh oh. Alpha goes down on the flank to Enigma. Enigma does go down, but there's it's a 4 on 4 fight right now. These next frags try with a big rocket on the YZ50. 1v1ing TLR on the bats, but uh oh. Mix up's DM Ruin comes in for the 2k, and this is looking like problems for Chess Club yeah, here. It is. The scout's gonna get taken down low left now any second. There we go. She's gonna roll on last. Focus down that demo now. If that's the demo, they can just sit on the point and let people come to watch them, and that's what's gonna happen. Yeah, nice play. Yeah. Ruin have a rough class, by the way. As soon, I think as soon as they realized they lost Platinum, they felt they have to create momentum with their Ubu, so they got they got to get scouts into the game instead of a sniper there. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Ruin, one of those players, I mean, one of the smartest scouts in the game, realizing, you know, I don't need a sniper now, the team's fighting, I need to be scout right here, so. I'm gonna be watching Ruin this next mid fight as he rolls up, doing the classic double jump onto the rock, actually delaying a little bit. Interesting to see, yeah. Really just worrying about early stickies from Alpha. Nothing really happening so far, so this is gonna come down to soldier aggression once again. Soldier's starting to bomb. Boomer goes down really early. Uh oh, Visitor goes down. 
Ruin in on KDK is able to drop him, does a lot of damage to... Who's that scout? That is... Uh, I always forget his name. Pinkerton, but that's not Pinkerton. That is... Omar. So, alias. The, um, well, the, the soldier aggression came in from both sides at the same time, and Enigma and his scout mod partner just uh, managed to get KBK there relatively easily in front of Sewer Gate, while um, the Medic Four mixup just stayed alive. And I think that's just what dominant, like what what enabled us to mid or them to mid even. Sorry, that they had heals afterwards and they could just walk over point. Yeah, for sure, for sure. So. Here we see Classic mix up with a full uber advantage, electing to go down this far left side, taking in a scout with a soldier here, so yeah, they're rushing this heavy. They want that kill and they get that heavy kill fast. I mean, Ruin still taking a good majority of the uber, going right into them, and with Enigma and YZ combining, this should be just another mix up round, so... Alpha with a 2k. Wow. Alpha gets a 2k, but in the end, that's already a quick 3-0 half for Classic mix up here, so... Wow. Right now, I mean, getting these scouts in on the Uber, I mean, mix up so far just seems <laughs> pretty dominant at the moment, wouldn't you say so? Ed? Yeah, it's like, I predict, I feel, I don't know, you guys probably have a different read to what's gonna happen to land, but I feel that mix up is gonna end up really, really strong, just with the mindset of having it, having it done before and wanting to get back to the I-series and want to beat the Europeans once again. They maybe have something proved right now and they just want to do it, so... You see, every single thing that they do on mids, like the aggression on the Matic and the combo in general, is just working out way better than it's happening for Chess Club right now. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Uh, what would you like to see different out of Chess Club? Like, what do you think they can do to sort of adjust the mix-ups game plan? Especially at these mid-fights where chest or mix-up just seems really dominant right now. I think they should just win their one-on-ones and maybe get... Like, they, they have a lot of sac like sacrificing play on the on the demo and the medic on mids. Maybe they should start to focus like the scouts of mix-up. Because like the scouts seem to be really dominant at times at the moment. Like the medic, they're trying... So far they're trying to go for platinum or the medic that is... Uh, um, what is it actually? The Matic 4 mix-up, sorry, the Matic. And KBK. Alpha oh. for, for chess or mix-up? Which... Alpha is demo for Yeah, chess so KBK, KBK is the Matic, yeah. I guess you're thinking of, yeah. And so far, like, they never really get the exchange, like, both. The soldier aggression is now so far coming in on the Matic. And mix-up is getting the opponent Matic, but it's not happening for chess club so far. So they get should stop doing that because it's getting predictable for... Uh, mix up and they should maybe go for scouts or just something else like maybe play a bit more defensive and see and let like the, the soldier aggression come into them and then deal with it while somebody's pressuring platinum because yeah platinum is also really uncontested as we are uh, we're going live this second half but anyways i think uh i'm gonna put the cam on boomer here is uh you know he's a numerous land attendee and definitely a solid scout and solid overall player but uh, let's see if they can sort of contain these mix-up scouts rolling out to this next bit as they're kind of delaying in the choke. They're not even contesting yet. Yeah, they're... They had some technical problems again. Maybe yeah. somebody lagged out. Oh, no. Yeah, I think and that's so that... what happened. Because their combo arrived on on the balcony when their people, their, the rest of the team was already in choke, so there were te technical problems again, I guess. So that is a second mid-fight where, I mean... Chess Club just couldn't show up in time because somebody lagging out, which is really unfortunate here, but not all is lost as the medic is up, so I'm they're gonna get this Uber in time. Yeah. Yeah, mix up I think mix up had no read really because they didn't know what was going on, they had no read on the enemy Uber, so they thought it's equal, but it wasn't actually equal. With thirty percent advantage on Harblue there. And the heck in sewers here, just seeing where people are holding, trying to spam people out of position. Enigma feeling a jump here a little bit, and then maybe oh, he gets caught off guard here. Actually, Jimbo goes down to the flank. Yeah, both teams are trading their roamers as the Uber does come in from both sides. A lot of flashing coming out of Classic Mixup, and they're gonna have to get out of the sewers. Bring the fight back to middles. Try is already in, and he needs the rest of his team as both the scouts come swarming in. Try to focus down Platinum, but TLR and Ruin combining to take down Try and Omar. Platinum does go down, but I mean Boomer. This unless he can get the scout kill, no Ruin. Ruin is just shutting him down and ruining his chances, and oh no, Alpha 
Trying to get through with the choke right now. Scout in on him, so why is he in ruin right now, I mean? The scouts for mix-up are just so dominant at the moment. Really just securing all these frags is... YZ50 gets another frag on the visitor, and TLR is able to snipe off KDK, so this is just pressure all over the map being applied by Mixup, and Chess Club at the moment just doesn't seem to have any sort of real response. Yeah, they were rushing in a bit, they got this early pick on Enigma, Enigma when they were holding second, and they rushed to to mid to try to get a, a bit of more frags here. Let's, let's see the Uber on last. So yeah, the Uber does come in, Platinum with a nice big jump, missing the pipes on the Visitor, uh-oh. <laughs> Is it gonna go down? The Heavy comes out of spawn, the Heavy's eating a lot of damage, but oh... Mixup has the two frag advantage, and pretty much that is what you want going into an Uber exchange. Once you get that two kills, but is this Heavy gonna be able to defend it? Wow. Oh my goodness, the Omar Heavy. Oh, Harblu gets a saw. Oh, he's gonna, he's gonna get it. He's gonna is he get gonna it. get it? Is he gonna, gonna get, get it? Get no! Oh. He kills himself. Oh, really oh my god. <laughs> That was that was just crazy. Awesome, awesome. So what I was saying was, when they got this early pick on Enigma, they rushed too fast into mid, and they don't have the synergy and the DM that Mixup has at this po at this point. So they just lost it on mid, and now they're on last. So we'll see how they retake now. Yeah, it's Instantly, uh, uh -oh. Boomer here. Wow, Chess Club trying to push out, but Boomer goes down. Trading YZ, uh oh, Try goes down as well. KBK and. I mean, Mixup is just dominating these transition fights, but Alpha doing so much damage in the lobby. Finally gonna get picked off. Oh, it's just Omar alive. TLR with 110, and no, TLR is able to secure the cap. Mixup goes up 4-0 here. Think Holy smoke. On mid, they should, a bit, they should make a mid, bit more room for Alpha. He's doing a really good job at the moment. I don't see him like underperforming in comparison to... To platinum in terms of damage and pipes and what he hits and whatnot. Like, he just needs to, a bit more work to, a bit more room to work on. So let's see what they focus now. Like, yeah, he's put Alpha's game. pushing up this right side, actually getting pretty good spam on the platinum. Platinum already really low and backing out of the choke. Visitor with a nice bomb on a ruin. Alpha jumping in here, doing a lot of damage with the stickies here. He has a scout on him. Oh, why is he 50? Juking him away and getting the picks, it's just Visitor up, and yeah, KBK is going to try to get out of middle, but yz 50 is on the warpath, he's chasing here, KBK hits a nice arrow on the wall, oh, oh my god, KBK, with KBK. the double arrow on the YZ50, and wow, that right there is just huge, KBK staying alive, he's going to have this 60% uber advantage, and oh man, 70% actually, and they have a scout pick, I imagine Chess Club, they're going to be moving out in the mid with this Ips. I think they should. Like, look at just the disadvantages Hard Blue has, and like Blue can set up a mid approach now. It can separate people on the right side and on the flank, just roll over them. Yeah, yeah so Tri is like... able to get a pick here on the platinum. Ruin goes down. The Uber is forced, but this is going to be a lot of picks for Chess Club. They're gonna. They should keep rolling here. They That's need to like keep going. They need to do the same thing that Mixup did to them that one round. And yeah, here they go. Pushing up, not even stacking the mid cap, taking what they can get, and they're locking mix up down. It looks like they're gonna be able to take two here, maybe for free off of this aggression. Uh oh, those visitor does get caught out. Yeah, mix up's gonna actually come out to contest this as soon as they get it. Yeah, TLR is he's jumping in, he's onto the combo choke. KDK with a really nice surf. Oh, a nice flash out of TLR. This scout's gonna go down a choke. Omar does go down. Is anybody behind at last? Back capping? No, it looks like all the chess club was able to make it out safely. So this is going to be a retake. Yeah, this is going to be a retake for Mixup here. As, uh oh, there is ooh, Enigma with a really nice flank on an Alpha. And that's going to cue the push in the mid here from Mixup. Yeah, Platinum jumping in here, going really high in the skybox. Ruins coming in now as well. Uh oh. KDK on really low health, Visitor really low health, they're eating so much damage right now, this mix-up aggression. YZ50 just on the warpath once again, Ruin right there with him, and wow, even though the scouts had a medic with them, Ruin and YZ just shoved them back, and that's gonna be another mid here for yeah. mix-up, they're just seeming so dominant right now. Plat did a lot of damage, and their scouts, they just listened to the calls that Platinum is giving them, and they're focusing down the weak people, and then instantly two, two really nice frags are coming in in return, so... Yeah, good but job both, both Ubers getting popped here. Uh-oh, YZ50 does go down at the start of this Uber. That's not what you want when you're classic mix-up, and sort of scouts are the backbone of your team. Is Yeah, they're starting to fall out this choke. 
Chess Club is trying to peek in. Visitor does a Boomer double jump down. in, but Boomer goes down. Visitor's in on the medic. Harblue at 80 health. Harblue at 35 health, but no, Visitor can't finish the frag. TLR with a nice 2k. Try getting a nice 2k. Frag's happening all over the place. Enigma is behind KDK. KDK on 70 health. Alpha surfs into the pack. The stick comes out, but no, Omar's got the cleanup, and wow. That was just hectic and all over the place. Here's YZ50 trying to come in with the flank. Alpha with a really nice pipe. Oh. Omar with the save. Alpha getting dropped down to 30 health there, but overall See, now, just a, a really nice fight. Why did he just go for the demo there instead of the medic? I, that's what I don't understand. Maybe I'm um, just too European there, but what we, what they, our scouts always try to do is just equalize the uber charges and then maybe drop the medic instead of a demo or something in return. Well, see, the so. thought process there, in my opinion, is if you shoot the demo, because, like, if you shoot the medic, the demo's gonna try to protect the medic, whereas, uh oh, platinum with the trap instantly drops scout and the demo and the ubers for us. Uh oh, this is just worst case scenario for chess club. Is yeah, tries coming in, trying to get what he can. Oh, really nice surf out of hard blue. Three health in the sewer. Visitor's gonna finish off the kill. But KVK, oh, Visitor gets another kill on the TLR. Visitor's just all over the place right now. He's still alive in the sewers. He's. He spazzed without trying to make it out to mid. Are they going to be able to finish him? Visitor's in oh. on platinum. Oh, he hits a nice rocket. Wow. Jesus. Jimmy, well, the, that left bicep coming in hot, picking up a big 3k. Do you think he could have predicted that if he just goes through his Oh, and go, man. Hey, to to be honest, in front of him. I, I don't know. That was just a big play out of Visitor. So, you know, Visitor kind of showing up the naysayers like, saying, oh, yeah. Visitor, not a good roaming soldier. But, I mean, right there. Coming up pretty clutch for the chess club. Oh, it's just well, curious. Yeah, but I mean, there's people in chat, and you know, plenty of open players that randomly give him smack oh, talk. But really, yeah. he's actually a good player. But uh, well, mix up actually trying to push in a mid while they're down. The scout really aggressive play, oh, but try. Huge. oh man, try taking down platinum, getting traded here. Boomer's getting a lot of health now. Is he gonna kill Enigma here? Enigma just on 60 health. We do have a spy coming out of Omar, so Omar making his spy play debut, really what he's known for. And so he's behind the medic, coming through the choke right now. Is Mixup gonna know this? He's hogging the wall, taking it tight. Scout, oh, it's hard blue! Really nice play. Oh man, so chalk one up for Omar there, bringing out the spy play, and he does take down hard blue. Spamming a couple of smiley faces there, and uh, Mixup not gonna be happy about that, but Omar definitely a little bit of a grin there, I have to say. And now what um, Cheslap did wrong last time when they rushed into middle after having a great dis uh, a great advantage was that they just they were just going too fast and they lost their one on ones on left and right and let's see how they retake take mid now. Yeah, uh, the Uber does get forced here. Try does come in in the mid platinum though. Caught no oh. land. Is he gonna be able to make it out? Oh my yeah. god, Plat with an incredible sticky jump out. Ruin and Hard Blue are down. There is a back cap as well. I believe this is YZ50 and I mean. When you have a scout like YZ50 behind you, that's kind of a scary prospect. Try though, and try and Enigma Omar combining to take him down. Enigma getting a kill on Visitor. And this is just action all over the place. I Two think there were three kills for Enigma on middle there, where, where the distraction happened with the back cap. Got three yeah. kills. There's just action all over the place right now. These teams are just making it a DM slugfest right now, but I mean... So far it looks it. like mix up slowly but surely pulling ahead in that race. Yep. Well, if you can if you compare the rosters to each other in terms of DM, I think um, Mixup will always have the the upper hand. If, wouldn't you agree? Oh, uh, yeah, I would. But, oh, there's a lot of aggression coming out of this choke. A lot of players in the deep red though for Chess Club. Uh oh, Ruin and Enigma Hopper down. Sort down. of the two big playmakers at the moment for Mixup. Hard Blue goes down. Visitor with a big jump on a TLR. He's leaving out a choke though with the medic. YZ50 on him. Can Visitor protect KVK here? No, it looks like YZ50, wow. Takes down Boomer, so it's him and Plat at mid. And they're gonna be able to hold on to this midpoint, but KBK with about an 80% uber advantage right here. I eat my words. BM. <laughs> they were able to just win that one on one there in that fight yeah, coming As we show. do have the, uh, the uber coming in through the IT here. Both soldiers jumping in. <coughs> Excuse me. Try is gonna be able to finish off Platinum here. There is a scout at choke. Uh oh, though. Visitor and Boomer, while wow, Omar's TLR, YZ50, Ruin combining for a lot of frags. Back half happening as well, and this is just 
Oh, nice air wow. shot coming out of try. Nice shot. Ruins onto him. Oh, he needs shots him for 60 health, but no, a ruin. And TLR Damn. finishing off the frags there, but I mean. I think you're right, when you think about, I mean, the rosters at this land in terms of raw DM, and you just look at mix-up, I mean, TLR... That would be a perfect example, to be fair. Yeah, Ruin, YZ, Enigma, Platinum, I mean, they're rolling in the last two, they smell blood, they want to end the game, and they're gonna just make it 5-0 here. So, mix-up with a pretty convincing win over Chess Club, just... I mean, it, it's hard to say, but they were just kind of outplaying Chess Club across the board, in my opinion. It's just really solid, yeah. solid play out of them. We saw it happening there uh, on mid, where Chess Club just went into mid with full uber advantage, and still the flank lost three to four people in that return, and then that's just that's just pure DM and synergy and coordination. Yeah, I bet it is. I mean, when you have scouts like Ruin and YZ50 on the flank, that's a dangerous prospect for anybody. As uh, bringing up the stats, we do have Ruin actually doing the most damage in the game at 78-72 as a scout, out damaging both his pocket soldier and demo man. So Ruin having a really stellar performance, going 25 and 12 as well. And, I mean, his scout partner YZ50 is no slouch either, going 25 and 15. So just. Really solid play out of the scouts coming out from Mixup, and I mean, TLR ended up top fragging in this match going 27 and 10, and I mean, Platinum 14 and 11, Enigma 14 17. Overall, though, yeah. just the frag difference and just the aggression from Mixup seemed like too much for a uh, chess club to handle. I don't know, like, you can always say that I'm completely wrong, dude, but when I saw, like, Boomer trying to initiate flank pace, plays there on left and right, um, Never really was too successful, and he ended up dead most of the time. So I feel that um, Ruin and Wide Fifty together with uh, Enigma on the flank just have such a good coordination that they just get this two or three people in return. Even if there's a Uber fight happening on mid, they can get the flank and then wrap around it. Maybe start an, a backup play or still like just outnumber the enemy team. And I felt like especially now in this process mid that Boomer was. Um, underperforming or not performing as I would expect somebody to perform on that level, to be fair. With like his, uh, I think, what did he end up, 8 points or something? Uh, well, Boomer actually going 16-20 and 20 for his team, putting up pretty respectable damage as a scout, but his scout partner, Omar, I mean, only doing 2600 damage, half the damage of Boomer right. going 12-22. Okay, okay. and 22. Try, though, okay. I mean, the pocket soldier wonder boy, Mr. Direx himself, going 21-17, and 17, Doing the most damage for his team, but at the end of the day, it's just not enough. And Visitor, the left bicep, going 11 and 21. I mean, doing relatively decent damage, but... I mean, Mixup just seemed like too large of a beast for Chess Club to handle. Yep.